What's up? My name is Techno here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll show you how to do something cool with VS Code. If you're someone who, say, works with remote servers or you run a lot of things in the built-in terminal, open it up with Control J, you may notice that after a while, you lose the ability to scroll up through your history. Say if I just find everything, you'll see that after a short while, the console fills up and I'm not able to scroll up anymore. Let's say you output a bunch of text from different files and you want to open it up to see what you have or something along those lines. If you want to see more line history in VS Code, it's very simple to go around changing. You can use this to both show more line history or less line history depending on your use case. Head across to File in the top left, then Preferences, and inside of here we'll head across to Settings. Then we're going to go and search for Terminal dot Integrated dot Scroll Back one word. Then we'll see this here. Terminal integrated scroll back under features and terminal. Controls the maximum amount of lines to keep in the buffer. You can raise this pretty much as high as you want. If I make it say just 10, click out to save it, then head back to my terminal here. I'm not able to scroll up. The scroll bar on the side is just a bit confused. Let's try and search again. And just like that, we have a much shorter history. I think I may have confused it with such a low number, but regardless, this is a lot shorter than what it was previously. If I change this to say six nines, click away and run another command here, very shortly, you'll see that this list is a lot longer. Of course, I'm not able to show you all of this, but regardless, there are a lot more lines here. You may notice that on slower PCs, things will start to lag, etc. Regardless, you now know how to change it. You'll want to periodically clear if you make this number pretty much infinitely high, but by doing so, you at least allow yourself a lot more control over the number of lines in your history. It's a very useful tip and something you'll more than likely want to raise, so that's exactly how you do it. Thank you all for watching this super simple guide. My name's been Technobi here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.